Hi there, how you doing? Uh, second devotion on our chapter in 1 Thessalonians. Uh, and let's just be clear, I'm not having prawn stir fry for, for breakfast. This is obviously the night before. I'm not that weird. I do like my food, but not that much uh, for breakfast. So uh, it's quite common for uh, Christians time to time to feel doubt about the gospel's power and uh, you know what's going on, especially in today's world. Uh, and one of the things I think we can take courage from in uh, the end of the chapter of chapter one in one Thessalonians is Paul commends the Thessalonians for just how uh, the gospel has reached them and how it's spread out and had a real impact in such a short space of time. And one of the things that's always been a, a key cornerstone to prove the power of the gospel is how fast it's spread in such a short space of time. Uh, any historian who is worth their salt, who looks at the, the whole impact of Christianity, uh, has to really deal with that question of how is it that this uh, small minority of people uh, saw something spread so quickly in amongst a, a pagan empire when there was anything up for grabs and you can just pick and choose as much as you want. This one thing uh, changed the whole world in, in so, so quick a fashion. And I think historically, scripturally, personally, we can take a lot of courage from that. That Actually, the gospel is true, but also it's powerful. It spreads. And so we have something that is, in, in all the things that we see around us holds firm. And so I pray that that would be something that encourages you, that if you're doubting, if you're thinking, you know, is this real? Is this have an impact? Go to the end of 1 Thessalonians chapter 1. And just be encouraged about how powerful the gospel is and how it spreads and changes lives. Let's pray together just as we think about that. Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord, as we reflected yesterday that your gospel is power. Uh, it's not just words, but it changes our lives. But Lord, we see its impact and how it changes other people's lives too. We pray, Lord, for our town. We pray for our nation. We pray for that gospel to impact powerfully, spread powerfully. Uh, amongst others too. In Jesus' name. Amen.